Hi everyone, welcome to our Facebook Live Coffee Catch Up with Christy in Quarantine Edition. Back again um, for another chat with you all. I have my coffee. We are back in quarantine in Melbourne, um, which is unfortunate. Um, but that's what's happening, that's what you gotta do. And I recently had my birthday, which was a lot of fun. I'm talking about something that gave me a giggle when I got to have um, look into it, um, which is uh, weird or quirky or funny or strange or odd or all of the above, wonderful um, uh, book titles and covers. My dog has just walked in there. Hi, Rosie. It's Rosie. Say hello. She's wearing a cute little jumper because cute little puppy um it's really cold in our house because our heater stopped working although we did just figure out the split system so hopefully this afternoon it'll be a little bit warmer <laughs> this is super timely if you were um remember just recently we had um crazy panic buying with toilet paper those people would hate this book because it's called toilet paper origami so I don't know if you can see that, but that's a little flower rose. Um, and so it's a book about how to delight your guests with fancy folds and simple surface embellishments. Girls who don't read are skanks, apparently. Now that was cool. That was a book as well. Um, that looked really old. That looked uh, like 50s. That looked super old. But apparently if you don't read, you're a skank. I think that's really mean. Um, <laughs> I don't agree at all. I'd be curious to read that though, just to see why they think that that's the case. Uh, better a sweater from a dog you know and love than from a sheep you'll never meet. This one was a lady book bird. Lady bird book. <laughs> lady bird book. All right, coffee time, because I'm thirsty. Why would you want to share that you learnt stuff about women from a tractor? It's really weird. It's not what it means. So this book is called Still Stripping After 25 Years but it's actually about quilting. <laughs> so um, apparently that's a term that you use for quilting, but it's literally called still stripping after 25 years with an older lady on the front cover. So this book is called How to Make Money in Your Spare Time. But the reason that it gets on the list is because the front cover has a man in a ski mask. And so <laughs> how to make money in your spare time. Let's, we'll just, you know, rob people i suppose if you've seen any um if you've seen any really weird or funny or quirky um odd facebook uh book covers or titles please let me know <laughs> i want to see those ones also <laughs> i had to include this because i couldn't believe that it was really a book look at that front cover <laughs> these things are crazy the manly art of knitting but they had to make sure you knew it was manly so there's a little cowboy sitting on a horse <laughs> Knitting, just in case you didn't think that knitting was manly. Um, where did I find these books? I found them in uh, on a, a search page. So I kind of looked up <laughs> funny, weird um, books that I could buy and you can buy these. So a lot of them are still available on Amazon. Um, I'll probably end up putting a link um, to the, uh, the ones that you can buy in my blog post, which hopefully I'll put up later today. Um, English, as she is spoke, a man with a horse head. Um, I don't know what that's got to do with English and how to speak English, uh, but apparently men with horse heads is how you speak English. So those are the ones that made my list. Uh, please leave a comment, let me know, send me a message if you found some really weird ones. Put a, put a picture in the comments, put a picture in the comments if you found another book title which is really weird. Share it around, give, give everyone a giggle, have a laugh. Um, if you're interested to know more about um, my book and where I'm going right now, um, my book title and cover hopefully won't be quite as odd, uh, but I have got a podcast which comes out. I'm going to bump that up to coming out once a week and so uh, the other half of my title and story release you get to know what it's called and um, what it's called and what it's about so that comes out hopefully next week and otherwise you know you can go on all of my social medias I'm glad that you came to this Facebook live thanks for everyone who actually came it was really great to see comments um, and 
Uh, if you still have any comments and you watched it later on, or you're watching a YouTube um, recap, then don't forget to comment below. Let me know about weird, crazy titles, and if you know where you can buy them, link them because I think I want to. I think I have to get on board with this and and buy a few of those of those weird ones because um, that just sounds really fun. I am gonna finish my coffee. I did too much talking and not enough drinking. Um, <laughs> but otherwise, I uh, hope you have a great rest of the day or night, whenever you're watching, and I'll see you in the adventures. Bye, everyone.